Oxjam started in 2006 and really it came about because there were so many young people that were really enthusiastic about Oxfam and enthusiastic about music. By creating Oxjam really we were able to tie those two things together. Oxjam 2010 is going to be absolutely huge, it's going to be our biggest event ever. We're going to have about 950 different venues involved. There are going to be up to 15,000 people giving their time, so that's musicians, that's people helping out on the door, that's all the you know, people organising the gigs themselves as well, which is a huge number. We're here at the Oxfam store in Dalston in London. It's the start of the Oxjam gigs and it's a brilliant lineup tonight. The Charlatans are headlining, Dan the Sacks is Scrooge's Pip. It's a really good lineup. All week it's going to be brilliant and of course then throughout October all the Oxjam gigs around the UK are in full swing, put on by volunteers. It's a brilliant way to start it, I think, tonight. Even if you don't enjoy our set, you're going to not enjoy it for charity. Our Oxjam is about loads of local promoters and local artists all getting to come together and do something under one big a, a banner so everyone can get involved, but it's all about your, your local scene. So hopefully when you go to Burnley, there'll be a small venue doing an Oxjam gig this month, but then you'll also have maybe Roundhouse will be doing something, you know, you, proper across the scale of the music industry. I think it's just about getting as many people involved this month, uh, October, uh, to do as much as possible really. I think the money goes to 70 different countries. It's something that you can do really locally, do something local, think global kind of vibe, you know. It's amazing, brilliant. It's been one of the best gigs I've been to. Think. It's been great to come to a launch gig in the Oxfam Dawson's shop. Yeah, it's, it's a good vibe, it's an unusual place to have a gig. It's, it's so good that you know you can combine like going out, having fun, like partying and like meeting cool people and then at the same time doing something good, you know, giving something back. Um, even though I'm, you know, like, yeah, it's a worldwide thing, man. I'm from Berlin, like this is London, but still, good thing. Like it, love it. We had the Charlatans yesterday, which is phenomenal. One of the great British bands. Tonight we've got Vickers. Look at the tiny little boots. And um, Pearl and the Puppets. Uh, fantastic new acts. Liz Lawrence, really good. And then we've got Johnny Burrell as well tomorrow night. That's going to be exciting because he's not done anything for a long time. I like performing in intimate venues because it's it's like a, it's a refreshing change and and it's you know this isn't a shop I mean, there's so much character to it. People should definitely get involved in Oxjam. You can get involved by just finding out where a gig close to you is going to be and getting yourself down there and getting all your mates down, or you can either put in your own gig and you know and be like yeah all the money's going to go. Talk fam, so it's easy enough as that, really. It's been amazing. So Diana Vickers has just been on, and she's just finished, and um, it was absolutely incredible. Felt very alive, and like we were in her front room, really. So yeah, really fantastic. It's really like intimate and lovely to see her so up close. I really enjoyed it. I've never been someone where you can like see a gig and shop at the same time. I think it's the future. This place is unbelievable, look, I mean just like, there's just stuff everywhere and uh, it's like, I'm actually blown away. This is the basement underneath the actual shop and um, there you go, that's all you need to know. John Coltrane, exactly. You might have found some uh, denim shorts, didn't you? Oh, I found some den denim shorts for like £2 and I found a, um, the Rocky IV soundtrack on vinyl, 12 inch, for 99 pence, so I'm chuffed with that. I'm not going to give anything away, but I think it could be a very special Christmas for my family. <laughs> <laughs> for Oxfam last December in the Bass Whip Play tonight. So no, we've got experience there. Yeah. Or uh, Ox experience. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> to be 
helping out in any small way is actually really, really good. Humbling, I suppose, in some way. I always think that just being in a band is part of the DNA. Of, of, it's, it's as British as being in an Oxfam. I don't think you could be English without having been in an Oxfam and shopped in one. Johnny Burrell on stage for Ox Jam 2010. Let's make some noise. Oh, don't go around the house. Just come back to me. I, I think I definitely purchased a set of golf clubs from this very Oxfam. I just think it's a brilliant idea, you know, and, and to get people involved with, you know, putting on their own gigs and em empowering people in that way is such a great thing, you know? And it's gonna raise shitloads of money and has raised shitloads of money for, for great causes, and that's just making the world a little bit of a better place. It's how to put you down when you're there. It's weird to see my local Oxfam made into a gig venue, but it really works. They haven't really moved anything at all either. It's just you can still go shopping and watch Johnny Burrell at the same time. <laughs> just jealous, man. Don't ever do the things that they wish that they could do so well. It was, it was extraordinary, actually. I felt quite honoured to come to a, a gig with Johnny Burrell and uh, to see him in the flesh. Maybe a lot of people here that would look at this and think, you know, why can't I do this for myself? So, you know, if you can do this here, then why can't you do it anywhere? It'd be great. to play somewhere really, really different. It's always kind of appealing and uh, Oxfam is obviously an incredible organisation and something I've always supported and believed in. So yeah, it's a chance for a good night, good music and uh, supporting something important as well. Enjoy music, support a great cause at the same time. We're excited about it. You can get involved yourself and you can do it yourself. Anyone can get involved. Not you. Please find out more on oxfam.org.uk forward slash oxjam. <laughs>